has to be bigger than that one lady in the Mario run right now. Oh, Flurry? <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, I, I will say this isn't normal for me. This, this isn't a normal Koopa Troop stream, really. It's, I'm a Nintendo kid. Every right, once I, in a while, I'll play some PC stuff. What are... Oh, never mind. Those are your skeleton friends. Yep, there is. A Did you level find anything over there? I'm. I was collecting sap. Okay, let's go see if we can find us a dungeon. I w I'm itching to do something. It's been too long without progress. Sounds good to me. I'm gonna head north. Yeah, I would recommend making a Twitch account. account. There, like, YouTube is nice, and technically the stream looks better on YouTube and stuff, but the community is a little bit better on Twitch, I will say. I would highly recommend it, but don't go out of your way to do it. Don't get me wrong, there's some things about Twitch that I'm not crazy about, but... I'm coming after you. It's uh, it's wherever you guys feel the need to chat. It it works out either way. All right. Well, to the north is plains. So we don't. Th this is a tiny misland section, I think, dude. Yeah, we might have to go off again. Um. So... Which sucks because we put all that work into that base. Well, that's not a bad thing because what we'll do. I'm going to run back through the portal. I'm going to put Misty 2 down, so when we get a new location, we can just teleport where we need to go. Oh, preemptively setting the portal down? Yeah. Good idea. I love it. Yeah, I think we're going to have to sail somewhere. Okay. Oh, there's a level 1... Seeker chasing me. So I'm gonna break this portal. So we'll have the respawn portal that we can place down at any time. And then I'll put Misty 2 down in the base quick too. The boat is uh south. Yikes. In that cove. Okay. I'm gonna head up this way really quick just to see what's over here. Okay. I know it goes into mountains, but I don't know. There's a little bit more section here. This looks messed up in here. Oh, there's a bit more mist lands up here. I'm on my way. Yeah, having a blank portal at home. Yeah, it is a good idea. I don't think we ever really did that <laughs> in this playthrough. We never honestly had the materials for it. Yeah, we weren't playing this easy last time. We had all the normal settings on when we played the first time. Everything that we built was farmed. It made for some chill material gathering streams, though. That's true. I had all my little tree farms going. Yeah, dude, this uh, this Mistlands biome is done for, I think. Is it? Okay. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it is. I think we should head to the boat. Sounds good. I'll head that way so you know where to go. Oh, so you're saying you don't even need a name for the portal. Like, if you just put it down and it's blank, it'll connect to another blank portal. Correct. Gotcha. Okay.
Right now we have Respawn and Misty 2 up though. To, to be used. Did you just get done streaming, Rocket? Yeah. How'd it go, dude? That wasn't in for very long, but... Yeah, when I joined your stream at first, I thought you were playing Persona. <laughs> That's what that game looked like. Yeah, I am at the boat. Okay, I'm almost there. I'm bringing some friends with me, though. Perfect. I forget, if you lose stamina while you're swimming, do you just, like, die instantly? E not instantly, but you have to struggle to get to the shore. Take us away. Away we go. You play vanilla, no modifiers, you're on day 2,328. <laughs> That's a lot of days. The Valheim? Yeah. Wow. How many years is that? <laughs> like, seven years or something? I think Odin's gonna get a little angry, like, what you doing down there, buddy? Alright, come on, Bo. You still didn't get the character you want. That's why you spend money on Rocket. What do you expect if you're playing a gotcha game? You have to spend some money to get the characters you want. You just don't get them by playing good. You got to throw down some cash. At least 50,000. Yeah, 50,000 gives you a chance at a legendary skin on Diablo Immortal. As long as we don't go too far south. Yeah, in game days, yep, gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Send me a silicone of your tummy so I can rub it for good luck. <laughs> My tummy. Uh, I don't think I'll be doing that. I don't think you want to see my tummy. I don't even have abs right now. Peaches has abs. One big ab. What? Just one big one? Rocking the one pack. We can't go that way, otherwise it's going to bring us to Ashlands and we'll die. So we have to go against the wind. And I don't have motor. So we'll, this is we'll going to be, be a fine. fun little adventure. Yeah, we'll journey and uh, just chill and vibe. If chat could just sing to us with People voice. rub Buddha statue or tummy for good luck. <laughs> well, Rocket, maybe you should become a Buddhist just for when you play the gotcha game. And then when you're done playing, you don't have to be a Buddhist anymore. I was watching a short and... I guess someone made a horror game of Asmongold's house. Okay. And he's like walking around and stuff. I don't know if it's fake or not, but there's a whole like trailer for it. <laughs> I think you should play that on one of your spooky streams. Oh god. I don't watch much Asmongold anymore. I, I mean, don't really know what he's up to anymore. You don't have to know. It's just spooky. I know his house is scary. Real time 1800 hours. That's a lot of hours. That's like my Monster Hunter hours. What the hell did we just hit? 
a wave. Mm. The wind is slowly adjusting for us. Rocket definitely has a tummy like Buddha. That's fine. There's nothing wrong with that. I thought it's bad luck to rub his belly if you're not Buddhist. Is that a thing? I don't know. I think so. Rocket, just try rubbing your tummy before you roll on a new character, see if it works. You don't need my tummy. He's up to exactly the same thing he's been up to his whole life. Well, I don't think he plays WoW anymore, does he? He plays a little bit of everything. Ooh. I know the new expansion comes out pretty soon. This looks promising. The game's definitely loading something in. It's loading something in that you can't see. Oh, it's certainly loading. It looks like a Minecraft world right now. It's loading block by block. call this home. Yeah, maybe if you rub the wrong tummy, it actually gives you bad luck. You might be right about that. You have to get underneath the folds to get the good luck. Yeah. You gotta feel the sweat. And the stink. Uh, looks like we got a little dungeon right there, possibly. That's a good start. You want me to mark where the boat is? I did. Okay. I made sure of this time. Uh, yep. We got a little cave system to go All through. Alright, let's go, dude. I'm so ready for this. Again, it, I'm, I'm thirsty for some content. Wait, never mind. Wait. This has got to be one, right? Um, what is this? It's just an abandoned dwarf house. What kind of dwarf is living in this place? What the hell is pushing me <laughs> off? Ones that can't get up the steps. Oh my god. That's so sad. I was so ready, dude. I know. That's just Miss Lands for you. Steps in and occasionally yell at the roaches. Those poor Wait, roaches. I see another one over here. Alright. Don't get me too excited. It's the top of some kind of structure. Are you Gosh, slower? Is it slower to regain stamina if you have a weapon out equipped? Like, is it better to run unequipped? Yeah, especially with a two-handed weapon. Okay. That's what uh, I it's, thought. It's dwarves. What can we do here? Nothing. Really? We gotta keep looking. They won't even, like, trade or anything? Nope. Well, that's sad. This, this is a big mistlands, though. It is. Okay. Ah, uh, let's see here. There is possibly something here. Uh, oh, it's a dwarf. 
this is a random little cubby hole you have. <laughs> There's a cloud bug thing. Oh boy. Okay. Um. I'm gonna run away. Can we kill it, you think? Yeah, just gotta shoot it with arrows. Okay. Which I'm almost out of arrows, so... I have a good amount. It takes more damage from underneath, right? Yeah. It's nice that yep. there's a dwarf here. It's... Dude, I think shooting arrows takes a little too much stamina. Uh, as you level it up, it takes less. Good. Nice shot. Yeah, you better run. I'm gonna put a bubble on us quick. He's fighting something else down there. The the Diverger buildings can have more Yggdrasil taps in them. Okay. Nice. You're hitting bullseyes with that uh, fireball thing, dude. Impressive. Just lobbing it. All right, now if we could see, that would be amazing. I think there's a swamp over to the south. Yep, I see it. Such there's garbage. a structure over this way, straight ahead. Okay, let's see what we got. Oh, it's a bridge. Um. This is the most random bridge ever. A bridge to nothing. Let's see. If there's a got mine, another, there will be seekers there. We got another dwarven building. So does it mean that if there's seekers in the world, there's a cave nearby? Because there's seekers over by me right now. I don't think that's true, because they kind of just spawn like anything. Okay. I think it's if you have a large cluster of them. This is definitely a massive Mistlands Island run. Well, that's good. It's a little sad we haven't found anything yet. Because if we go pretty much straight east from where we are, it just opens up into Mistlands. Okay. Did you say on the last one we were on that had the boss spawn? I thought it was, but it was not it. Oh, okay. It looked kind of like it. Another dwarf tower. I've never ran into this many dwarven ones. You remember how this world layout was just super weird in general? Everywhere we went? Yeah. Back in our playthrough. Like the mountains. Remember we found like eight little mountain biomes? <laughs> That's really nothing in them. With nothing. Just like one tall mountain with nothing. It took us like five hours to find motor. Crap. 
If one of those ruins, like the empty one you were at, has seekers crawling on it, it has a mine inside. Otherwise, it's just dead ruins. Okay. I think I found one. Yep, I'm on one right now. Yeah, I'm pretty close to you. I passed right by this. I must have missed it. Oh, are you serious? No! Oh, there's another one of those things. Yep. Oh, God. I was, I'm trying to run from that while also trying to fight off three Seekers. Yeah, I just killed one. Okay, well, I'm gonna go in here quick. Is there a door? Here it is. It would be a staircase, I think. Uh, yep, we have a mine. Oh my goodness, I'm almost dead. You want to just run in here? Well, I killed the flying dude, four seekers, and a bunch of ticks. Jeez, dude. If it wasn't for my magic, I'd be screwed. Let's go inside, shall we? Yes. Gotta re-eat. How close to you do I need to be to get that bubble when you use it? Like mm, pretty close? Pretty close. I'll give it to you once we're in there. Okay. I'm almost out of magic food, so I'll have to cook some of that soon. You're not supposed to physically find boss arenas. You're supposed to come across the Vagvasir stones. Yeah, I remember that. I, we weren't finding very many of those. <laughs> I fell again. Um, you doing okay? Yeah, there's just a lot of seeker broods down there. I'm alright though. Your bubble certainly helps. I'm gonna recharge it for you. Thank you. Bugs on both sides, cool. Five meters worth of space. <laughs> yeah, let me get cool. let me get my meter stick out a second. Nothing. All right, dead end. I don't think there will be anything down there except for things to fight. Okay. Um. Guess we'll go this way. Yo. Oh.
dead end, really. Oh, okay. Man. There's gotta be like a secret door somewhere. You said there's usually nothing down these pits. Usually it's just things to fight, so if you fall. Is this seriously done? <laughs> We have two more directions to go up this way. I forget if we've been this way or not. Go back to the entrance if you go left from coming in or right if you are going out. Yeah. There's a double path I'm following right now. Okay. Yeah, this is a dead end too. Little dwarven room with some sausage and gold. Oh. Oh geez, I almost died. I am very close to death. Fall. Okay, here comes the one star. He's kind of glitched. Ow. Harry, nice. Man, they hurt. They do. Oh, that's why I'm afraid to go back to Ashlands. The difficulty? Yep. Yeah, I'm a little scared for it too. I feel like I don't play this game. I die a lot. Like, if it wasn't for your bubble, I feel like this would be, like, impossible. Yeah. You know? It'd be, it'd be tough. Alright, so we've gone through four dungeons now and have yet to find one single piece out of nine. That's awesome, dude. Really looking forward to this. I fell again. <laughs> it mums the word when we go... I'll just give us a boat. <laughs> I mean, I'm getting the general idea, I feel like. I do want to upgrade this armor, though. So we got to find those skulls. Yeah. Even that, I'm shocked we haven't run into a single one. Wait, got some bones. Good sign. Didn't you say that there was like some flesh inside of a wall before? <laughs> you remember that? Flesh inside of a wall. Yeah, when we played with Neil, you like had the mine into the mountain because some flesh spawned inside the rock. Yes, because the skull spawned with the mountain over it. <laughs> Amazing. Alright, I'm gonna jump across this. You can weapon trade by ha having a player hold up a shield and having the other player attack with that weapon you're trying to level up. <laughs> what? Oh gosh, darn it. Stay away. Get out of there. Punched it. Oh. 
Oh, you just have oh. to turn friendly fire on. Gotcha. Interesting. Um, we, oh man, I'll head north. Okay. Oh gosh darn bubble monster and I only have one arrow left. Uh, there is certainly something here. There's like wooden walls. Oh, we can get flesh there. We just have to fight dwarfs for it. There's a lot of seekers here, too. Frickin' stamina. Oh my god. The bug guy is here, too. Or the whatever he is. Is he really? Yep. Where at? Over by me. I'm in a pretty bad spot. I guess I'm safe in here. Come in here, Seeker, I dare you. I don't see him. Of course, I can't fucking hit it. Yeah, I don't know what they were guarding. That was a dwarven mine, so we can get flesh out of that. Okay. You have a bubble? No, I ran out. All right, we're gonna need can that. You, should you summon out. skellies? Uh, they don't really help against that. That's so sad. Unless I'm lucky and get archers. All right. My one arrow. I have a lot of arrows on me, but they don't do much damage. Let's hit him in the belly. Oh, crap. Yeah, dude, I do no damage. Even if I hit him in the belly. No. I, that was so close. <laughs> Come on, stamina, let's go. Got oh, him. nice. Okay. By flesh, does he mean soft tissue? I have no idea. Whatever it's. Yes. Yeah. I've never seen it, so I don't know what it's called exactly. Where is that camp at? Uh, good question. Somewhere really close. Um, I think it's north a bit. Yeah, this crack looks familiar. Yep, the seeker I was fighting is in here. Right down this way. Alright, down in this hole there should be soft tissue there's definitely seekers oh cool this looks like an abandoned one so there's any left it just of keeps course. getting better and better doesn't it this is the best all right <sighs> you're losing your mind I am. Um... All right, let's see. There has to be something cool. We've been playing for here. almost three hours, and it's 
crazy that we haven't gotten one of these fragments. Or ran into a single skull. Yeah, that too. Giant brain matter, ew. Well, I think I found a new place to fight. Me too, actually. Right when you said that. It's a dwarven site, though. Wait, never mind. This is the one with the broken dwarf house. Yep, they're living here. Lots of mages here. That's a good place to hide. This place is huge! Dude, there's like eight dwarves here. A one-star dwarven mage, wow. You guys got a nice little place here. Yeah, I won't I won't upset them. I don't intend to do that. They will rock your world. Can you guys tell me where the nearest skull is? Am I opposed to using the world map generator? Uh, I don't know. Probably not. <laughs> not if it speeds up the process at this point. I mean, honestly, if it comes down to it, I'm tempted to just have Peaches go back to his world and bring the fragments here because I think I've gotten a decent taste of what Miss Lance is. Crap. I, I found, oh, I thought it was a skull. It's ancient armor. Dang. In another dwarven settlement. <laughs> Dude. Wait, there's a tick here. Neil was saying there's a chance that, uh. The ticks like the hideout there? That there could be flesh around. Okay, good luck. Or it could have just been from the giant floaty thing we killed. They dropped ticks. Yeah, I, that's interesting. I'm not sure if I want to use the world generator or not. I do like exploring and filling in the map myself. I feel like that's what Valheim's all about. Like, I, I truly don't mind this. It's just, honestly, the mist is annoying. It is kind of annoying me. I know there is a mod that you can download to get rid of the mist mostly. Like, the mist can be here, but I think it's a little overkill. Or, like, at least with the wisp light, like, have it do a little bit more. Yeah. But I know what they're going for. Like, I don't know. A larger area, at least. Yeah. Or, like, be able to upgrade your wisp light or something. Or only during storms does it get this bad. A lot of seekers here. I'm getting messed up. Stamina is certainly an issue. I don't know if this is dwarves. It's gosh darn dwarves. Ugh. Yeah, the Mistlands gear is unavoidable. Yep. I know it is. Crap. I, th I found one, dude. Found what? Uh, a mine Let's... with a staircase going up. Okay. There's a level one seeker here. 
I don't know if I can take it by myself, honestly. I'm on my way. It's a little bit steady. If it gets too scary, I'm going to run inside. Oh, he flew away. Oh, there he is. <laughs> oh, crap. Yeah, dude, I'm a little scared. I'm going to run in. I just don't want to die. Oh, you're really close, dude. Yep. I'm coming right now. You use dev commands on your solo world. There's large mist torches you can spawn in. That sounds pretty nice. <laughs> large? Like the dwarven ones? Uh, It's the one from the lighthouses. I don't know what that is. Neither do I. I've never messed around with the dev plans. Well, it sounds like there's at least a way to get rid of some of the mist with it. Parrying with this pole arm is still nasty, dude. It does good damage. I gotta start doing that more. I also don't have a bubble on me. I'm almost out of magic food. Let's make this quick. Oh, my inventory weight is full. It's all that carapace mostly. One dead end. How you doing down there? Uh, pretty good. That's a large mine likely to have a piece in a ve sphere. <laughs> good. You know, that's what we thought of the previous <laughs> four mines we've gone through. That's Wait, true. I see a piece. Look at down there. See that hole? Yeah. There's a piece right there. Perfect. Oh, yeah, I see it. Oh, can't shoot down that. Should I pick well, up and some of these circling cores? And there's a piece right there. Holy oh, dude, smoke. I have so much gold on me weighing me down. That's what it is. All right. Okay, well, we have one for sure. We have two for sure. I just picked up another one. Nice. Oh, jeez. They're coming, dude. Nice shot. <laughs> Point blank fireball. Dunzes and dragons, we'd be dead right now. No. Oh, yeah, we would. I have plus six to... Oh, no. Probably soldiers. Don't say that. I'm in danger. Are you? Okay, I'm coming. <laughs> Did you go down the hole? Accidentally. Okay. I'm here. What's down here? Don't. Oh! Uh... <laughs> this is exactly where I want to fight these things. There's our second piece. There's another one here. Wow. Nice. We're loading up on this one, dude. Things are turning yeah. around. It's Look making up for all the other mines. Yeah. Ah. Nice shot. Oh, my God. Okay. What a good team we are. Let's see, dead end. There's still a lot of enemies somewhere. 
Sounds like they're behind this wall. I know there was a whole group of them up here behind some metal bars. So it has to be... I need to drop some of this gold. Sorry to oh, do it. found them. We don't really need gold, luckily. I know, it, just, it doesn't seem that useful. That is a bunch of one-star seekers. Yes, it is. I need to eat again. Probably a good idea I do that. This mine is crazy, dude. Look, another piece. Wait, never mind. That's just a black gem. Oh, dude, excited. there are so many enemies here. You are destroying them with that. Oh my god, let dude. Let me rebubble you. You are wreaking havoc. Wow, they broke my bubble instantly. There's a lot going on, man. This is like a whole nother dungeon in here. Yeah, it's like two in one kind of. Oh my god! <laughs> what is happening? I like how you shoot a fireball at me to get the tick off. Yeah, there's another piece right here. Nice. Oh, it's a room full of ticks. It's really ticking me off, dude. How many is that? Five? Uh, four? Four. Four out of nine. Okay, we're pretty much halfway. This is good. We still have a lot of dungeon to Should we bust this through. down? That leads back to where we came from. Or, one of the areas we already cleared. Well, th these metal bars I was talking about. It's a separate room. Yeah, that le we've already been in there. Oh, we have? Yep. We were okay. on the opposite side of that at one point. Good thing you're here, because I don't remember these things. We got back here. Thank you, Gunthor. You're welcome. Oh my god. You, you nearby? <laughs> uh, yep, come to the hole. Please do. He's really trying to get you. Wow. I'm clearing out this upper section that's massive too again. You need me up there? Um, I should be good. Doesn't okay. seem like there's anything up here alive. Just let me know. Oh. Well, I revealed where the queen is. Very, very nice. Super far away. Is it? Yep. Yeah, better than not knowing. That is definitely true. What is the uh, boss buff for Mistlands? Uh, um, increased mana regen. So not really anything I'm interested in. Oh, and mining. Oh, that's not bad. I wish there was a boss. Well, I guess Ekthir kind of, but just stamina regen. Like massive. <laughs> yeah, that would be nice. I don't know what the Ashlands boss gives. Wait, did you ask about Ashlands or Mistlands? 
miss lands. Okay, yeah. I'm in a rough spot. I'm gonna bubble you up. Please do. It's coming back. Might be it. At least for this huge section of the dungeon. Oh yeah, I'm sure there's more back where we came but from, but that was wild. Yeah, that it was, was a lot. Not a lot of one stars, which is nice. There's a couple. Damn it. Trying to decide what to bring with us. Those I can grow. It's cool because this actually feels like a nest. Yeah, there's a lot to kill. I found the new section over here, I think. Should I be picking up these black cores still? No. Okay. All right, I found the entrance. Oh, this must be where you found the boss spawner. So you've been over here. I still hear enemies nearby. Oh, they're in here. Yeah, they're down there. There's probably nothing down there. Alright, so this is the staircase you're looking for. Right here. We're leaving? Yeah. Yep, that was everything. That was a pretty fruitful wow. one. Well, we... Very nice. We four of nine. Sadly, um... Not everything we needed. Still, though, that's encouraging. Uh, uh, crap. I think it was here. You found one, too? No, uh, I put down the Misty 2 portal over here. Okay. When I, when I heard you were in danger. I just dropped one. Very smart. I think it is this direction. I want to go remove that. Oh, yeah, I think it's on top of this building. This was the Dwarven settlement I had found earlier. Wait, did I put it up there? Maybe I didn't. Had to switch phones in here if he asked anything. No, I was just screaming in terror. That cave was loaded. We made it out alive, though. Lots of enemies were in there. Yeah, this is definitely our best shot at getting um, some of the flesh around here, though. Massive. Yeah, there still hasn't been a single skull. I'm sure there's some around here. It's huge here, but still. All right, we can run back and drop stuff off. We got four. Wait, what did you say? We got four or five of those shards? Four of nine. Okay. 